New tonight as the high school volleyball season winds down, one local team is looking to make an impact in the playoffs. Greater High School's girls volleyball team was perfect in Midwestern Conference play without dropping a set in any game. NBC5's Zach Larson is live in studio after talking with the team about their recent success. Zach. Jenna, the run that Crater Volleyball is on right now is impressive, but what makes it even more remarkable is the fact they haven't played at their home gym all season. One, two, three. Woo! Perfection is tough to come by, but for the girls volleyball team at Crater High School, that's exactly what they hope for coming into the season. The 36-0 is good. That's, that's, that's uh, quite an achievement in and of itself. Uh, we are far from perfect, as my girls will frequently tell you. Uh, <laughs> Head coach Leif Jensen came back for a third stint at Crater starting this year. This season, they have a record of 18-4. In Midwestern Conference play, they went 12-0 and never lost a set in any of those games, a feat he's never seen before. Not in our conference before in all my years of doing it. Even uh, this is the third title we've won with that on teams that I've coached, and we've been pushed every one of those seasons. We've never had a season where we haven't dropped a set. However, what's more impressive is how the team is doing it without their home gym. The gym is getting a major makeover at Crater High, forcing the team to move and play their games at Scenic Middle School. It's definitely odd because the gym is a lot smaller than what we're used to at Crater. Not as many people can come. It's just kind of smushed. And so it's not exactly the best, but it is what it is, and I'm still getting to play with my teammates. While there are several special players on the team, three seniors, Kate Stidham, Madison Cosina, and Kendra Biddle, have stuck together as teammates since sixth grade, making for an unbreakable bond. They're my best friends on and off the court, and um, we've grown and developed together, and we're just good. Something that separates this team from others is their size and they're hoping to use that to their advantage to win a state championship. Teams definitely see us, they get a little intimidated. I mean, like I said, we have a very big offense. Like most of our players, even some of our defenders are pretty tall. So I think we definitely look intimidating when people see us walk in the gym. If you want to catch the team's first playoff game, it's tomorrow at 4 p.m. against the Dallas Dragons at Scenic Middle School. Live in studio, Zach Larson, NBC5 News.